What's up guys, it's Jeff with I Download Blog. I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 5.1.1 using the non-DFU mode backup slash restore method. This is very similar to the A5 jailbreaks like uh, Rocky Raccoon and Corona that you guys are used to before. Now let me just show you, I'm running 5.1.1 on my device. I have the latest version of Red Snow downloaded on my uh, MacBook here as you see. And you can get that from iDownload Blog of course. All you need to do, this is super easy, you don't even have to go into DFU mode. Make sure you have Redstone 0.9.15 Beta 2, click Jailbreak, it'll ask you, use DFU RAM disk method, which is the old school way you can choose whether you want to do that or not. The DFU RAM disk method is preferred if you have a lot of apps and a lot of music and stuff like that, but if you have a fresh clean install, just go ahead and click no. And let me show you how this works. Just like the Rocky Raccoon, it actually is the same exact method that A5 devices use for their jailbreaks, which is really awesome. So it just goes through processes and it'll actually do a restore with the jailbreak. So it's just like, you know, back with Absinthe and things like that, you see where it says jailbreak succeeded, and now we are good to go on our device here. The jailbreak is done, folks. All it's gonna do is complete the restore process, and that's it. You'll have Cydia on your device ready to go. And since this is iOS 5.1, no need to do any tethered boots. This is an untethered jailbreak. So let's just wait for a few minutes here, and we'll just wait until this restore completes. Now, first of all, the screen is going to come back to your lock screen initially. In just a second, you'll see the little Apple logo loading here for a little bit. And this shouldn't take long at all. And it's almost complete. Okay. And then we should be right back at our lock screen here. So there we are. Now you want to wait a second time because it's going to actually respring again. Just be patient here. No need to slide to unlock or anything like that. Just let the screen stay black for a minute and then you'll see the little spinning logo here in just a second, which will respring your device and then Cydia will be ready to go on your device here. So we're gonna give it a few more seconds. There we go. Just like we said, respringing and there we go. Now we're good to go. Let's go ahead and unlock our device, swipe over and bam, there is Cydia, just like that. No DFU mode, no lengthy jailbreak process or anything like that. Just load it up and now you'll see the message that, you know, takes a little while preparing file system. So this takes a, a while. So just be patient on this. I've sped this up a bit just for your convenience. But once that is complete, folks, you're good to go. And you can begin using your jailbroken iPhone using Cydia just like that. So let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section. This is Jeff with I Download Blog.